Have you ever felt like your mind is racing, emotions overwhelming, and you're not in control? What if I told you that mastering your mind and emotions is not only possible, but essential for living a fulfilled and peaceful life? In this video, I'm going to show you powerful techniques to take control of your thoughts and emotions, so you can unlock your full potential. But first, let's dive into why most people feel so out of control. In today's world, we're constantly bombarded by distractions, social media, notifications, work stress, even our own thoughts pulling us in every direction. It's no wonder so many people feel anxious, lost, or emotionally drained. The good news? You don't have to be one of them. By the end of this video, you'll have the tools to master your mind. The power of awareness. The first step to mastering your mind and emotions is awareness. You can't control what you're not aware of. Most people live their lives on autopilot reacting emotionally to everything without ever pausing to reflect. But you have the power to change that right now. Next time you feel your emotions starting to spiral, pause. Ask yourself, what am I feeling? Why am I feeling this way? This simple act of bringing awareness to the present moment interrupts the automatic patterns of emotional reaction. In this moment, you regain control. Your mind will try to tell you stories, but you don't have to believe everything it says. When you become aware of your thoughts and emotions, you gain the power to choose how to respond instead of reacting impulsively. Breathing the key to emotional control. Now that you've become aware of your emotional state, let's talk about the most effective tool for calming the mind, breathing. It might sound simple, but intentional. Breathing is one of the fastest ways to take back control of your emotions. When you feel anxious, stressed or overwhelmed, your breath becomes shallow. To regain control, try this. Take a slow, deep breath in through your nose for four counts, hold it for four, and exhale slowly for four. Do this three times and feel your mind start to quiet. This simple technique lowers cortisol levels, reduces stress, and shifts your focus back to the present moment where your mind can't control you. The mind as a tool not a master. Now that you're more aware and calm, it's important to remember this. Your mind is a tool, not your master. The mind is brilliant. It solves problems, creates ideas, and helps you navigate the world. But left unchecked, it can also become your worst enemy, filling your life with fear, doubt, and negativity. Imagine this. You're sitting at home and a negative thought pops into your head, I'm not good enough. Does that make it true? Absolutely not. Your mind generates thousands of thoughts every day, but here's the secret. You don't have to believe all of them. When you see your thoughts for what they are, just thoughts, you take back control. Start observing your mind like an outsider. When a negative thought appears, acknowledge it, and let it go without judgment. Reframing negative emotions. The next step in mastering your mind and emotions is to reframe negativity. Emotions like anger, frustration, or sadness are not inherently bad. They're signals. The key is to learn what they're telling you. For example, when you're angry, it's a sign that something feels unjust or out of alignment. Instead of letting that anger control you, ask, what can I learn from this? Reframing negative emotions into something constructive is a skill that will transform how you respond to life's challenges. Visualization. Create the reality you want. 
One of the most powerful ways to control your mind and emotions is through visualization. Just like a pro athlete visualizes their victory, you can train your brain to focus on positive outcomes. Visualization tricks your mind into thinking you've already achieved your goals and this releases the emotions associated with success. Next time you're facing a stressful situation, visualize yourself calmly handling it. Picture the ideal version of yourself, confident and in control. Over time, your mind will start to align with this vision and your emotions will follow suit. Daily practice for long-term control. Mastering your mind and emotions isn't something you do once, it's a daily practice. Incorporate these habits into your routine. Awareness, intentional breathing, reframing negativity and visualization. Remember, each time you consciously take control of your mind, you're training it to be your ally, not your enemy. Over time, you'll notice that situations that once triggered stress or anxiety now feel manageable. You'll respond with calm, confidence and clarity. Unlocking your true potential. Controlling your mind and emotions is the key to unlocking your full potential. With awareness, breathwork, mental reframing and visualization, you can finally stop living on autopilot and start living with purpose, peace and power. If you found value in this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more life-changing content. And remember, the mind is a powerful tool when you learn to control it, you control your life.